Hello, and welcome to my second cast for DDGamer.com forums. This is a Silver League play between Tawn, who's the red Protoss, on the northeast, northwest side. And on the northeast, we have Topos of Sets. I'm going to be calling him Sets. He is blue, and he is Protoss as well. So, PvP. Love those mirror matchups. I want to clear the air a bit, real quick, because in my last cast, I incorrectly judged Hydralisks to not be very good against gateway units, which they are. They are very good against them, because I did the research and, you know, I was just incorrect. Pro putting down a pylon, probably going to be a fast expand, but just wanted to clear the air. I put down annotations in my last cast, and I've apologized, because it was just incorrect and that's unacceptable to me. I strive to be the best, and I will. That is just how it'll be. Over here, Seth setting down his own pylon at 10. Gonna be a supply blocked a bit. A little late on it. I believe this is a silver league game, so... Not the highest level, but, you know, it happens. People get supply blocked. Gateway coming down. Chrono boosting out those probes. Meanwhile, Ton probing up. Chrono boosting those out as well. Looking for his thing. For the opponent, can't quite find it yet. It's gonna be the last place he looks. Simulator coming down. No simulator for Ton yet. And it looks like Sess will find him right off the bat. First place he looks. So, advantage for scouting. Will be about the same actually because set topos just didn't do it quite fast enough. There's the forge fast expand. Here come the two. Here's the fo one photon cannon and another pylon. Gonna avoid the artosis pylon. Uh oh, Ton sitting down. Pylon of his own. Meanwhile, across here, here's a pylon over here as well. So, a bit far away for a cannon. Oh wait, there's another one. This perfect position for a cannon rush, but this one's an even better, even better than perfect. But with this, he can block the ramp, which is very important to make sure he doesn't get away. Should he be photon cannon rushing, which he is, it could have been a gate, but it's not. It's photon cannons. It makes sense. This was just a ploy, it seems. Very clever. This probe just. Chilling out. Don't think he knows. But nope. He is just blissfully unaware of how much cheese he is in. Keeping up with the production of probes. Bring up the production tab. Making probes. No probes for Ton. Not quite sure what that's about. He needs to be making probes and he needs to be chrono boosting the probes out. Because if this fails, then he's not going to have anything. Right now, that doesn't look like he was going to fail. It looks pretty good. Tapos now obviously sees that they're there. And that probe just got wasted. I don't know how Sense is going to get it out of this. He is pretty well blocked in. No photon cannons coming up. These probes might succeed in taking out this photon cannon, but this one's going to come up and just waste them again. And I don't think they're going to get it down. Nope. So that photon cannon will come up with zero damage done to it. Meanwhile, just trying to chrono boost some probes. Get as many minerals as he can. He still has a probe over here, so... If this entire base gets taken out, if he doesn't make any units, he might be able to come back. Because this one photon cannon isn't going to do anything. But he's got a pylon. He's got a pylon up here. So he's not bad, but he is getting wrecked. No pylons. One pylon up. Gonna try and get a zealot out. He won't do much. Because these photon cannons are just gonna rip through everything here. And I, yeah, he walled it off. So everything in here is just going to get destroyed. There's, just, there's no getting around it. So what I think he's going to be doing is getting as many minerals as he can, and if he's smart, 
he'll... Yep, there he goes. He did get the warp gate technology up, so... That's not much of a... Not much of a helping hand, but... It'll get him out a little bit faster. So, if he catches him off guard, he won't be able to make any units in time. But yeah, this is all going down. 600 minerals. Just 100 for Ton. So he's not going to be doing much. This next is going to be cancelled. And a gateway is going to come down. This one's almost up. It'll have to switch to a warp gate. I don't believe Ton knows about this. No, he doesn't. So, he probably thinks he's got this game in the bag. Which, he wouldn't be too far off. Yep. Being revealed. Now he knows about it. And, uh, here comes the warp gates. This gateway not quite done. Ton throwing out the preemptive GG. I'm not sure if that's wise. He's not in as good a position as he thinks he is. These probes are done for, but all he has to do is move them out of the way. They won't die, but they won't do anything useful, I don't think. Nope. Here comes the other warp gate. Not sure why he hasn't warped in. There we go. There's the zealot. Up in the other one. And I believe is to initiate the attack. Yeah, I think Todd knows that he's done for. Because he has zero units. Nothing. <laughs> Four zealots. <laughs> That'll win you the game, I guess. Gonna ring. Gonna play ring around the. Oh, no. Here's the engagement. And those probes aren't gonna stand a chance. There goes the probes. And there goes the Nexus. I believe he's gonna put down a nexus right here. Yep. Not being revealed anymore. And I think that's it. I think that's game. Because there's nothing Tong can do. Any second now. There we go. Rebate complete. So, very good job by Set avoiding all of these can. Well, he didn't avoid them, but he didn't lose to them, which is saying something. It's a good job. Alright, this is Osborne. I'll uh, see you next time.